to just five big vibes welcome let's talk about love island all stars episode four <sighs> it was giving okay so let's start it like this right molly was enjoying having all the attention and she liked the attention from chris he was funny everything was good so she's like oh i'm gonna show callum you can see that she kind of still wants callum back not even kind of she really really still wants callum back but what she wants is for him to actually be who she wanted him to be in the relationship that made it not to work that's what's given right so she went ahead chatting with chris and then Chris kissed her. She kissed him back. It was not just a kiss whereby uh, one person kissed and it was not reciprocated. It was reciprocated. They talked about the kiss after. Then it clicked to her. Come, come, come. Colour may now feel like I have done something really wrong and he may not be interested anymore. He might now go out with someone else or whatever. So victim Molly played in. Because that's what it's giving me. Like, what is this? Oh, I didn't know we were talking then. All of a sudden we kissed yeah he was flirting you could see it and so now what she's saying is that he just grabbed her and kissed her and it wasn't consensual that's what she's kind of saying without saying it because fast and now she's like he has automatically given her the egg because he has served his purpose but now the purpose that she wanted him to serve she feels like he has over served the purpose now so he's automatically giving her the egg because it's like she was talking to Callum and then he's like he was going to oh if he pulls me for a char like under her breath i swear to god like what would you do what would you do <laughs> honestly i cannot stand people like that it's just like the way she just turned everything around for chris is even like the way she's behaving like chris is going to now go be like the guy that girls are not interested in very soon he's gonna be that and he wasn't ever that that's one reason why you should like honestly i don't want to talk about that anyway according to chris he had a boner but yeah i guess now he doesn't have any anymore <laughs> Kaz saying she likes Louis. Every time Kaz say I like Louis, I'm just like, Kaz, no. And then today, for the first time, he said that he was for Demi and Kaz. He did say that, like, he was keeping his option open. But anytime he spoke with the boys before, he was always like, oh, um, Demi or whoever else. He was never Kaz. He never even talked about Kaz. So I knew that he was not interested in Kaz, but Kaz didn't know because obviously she does not know because she has not been in his conversation with them we can see she does not see it so she's thinking like he's this cool person that doesn't talk but then with demi he's talking he's flirting he's putting in the work whereas with her she starts the conversation she does all the flirting like honestly like tonight right when she was saying trying to suggest that they should go to the um they should go to the terrace to you know to like ah, i've not been to terrace no kind of suggesting that they should go to terrace to have uh keys i was like Kaz, no 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 i didn't even finish my no he was already kissing demi i was like huh did i say no did i not say no Kaz, you could hear me through the screen did i not say no but at the end of the day i do understand Kaz. you're in love island if she stays there and not flow anybody and not talk to anybody it's gonna end up with her going home i don't want her to go home but love island prison why are you guys doing this to Kaz and liberty honestly they came in in 2021 they were the people that people were not like they uh, liberty thought she had a relationship from the beginning but the guy didn't want her he was just she was just a placeholder all through and then Kaz went through nobody wanted her nobody wanted her nobody wanted her nobody wanted her, nobody wanted her until during Kaz even the person that really didn't want her but then she chose him because of uh, what um the other guy was doing i think his name was tyler i can't remember but yeah because she chose him because of whatever he was doing the guy now somehow got the sympathy of everybody because somehow she she blew him off when he never showed attention so she ended up coming in to love island going out to someone that doesn't really like her and then ending the relationship ending now again for past seasons you guys have tried there have been lots of black guys that you guys bring or guys that are interested in black women like for instance um scott is interested you know what i mean there have been that kind of people so can you guys not bring those people they are from love island they could come in for the Oscars. can you not bring those people to come for Oscars so that that way we have someone that likes both white and black girls so that way the black girl is not going to be the one that seems unattractive just because the guys don't like black girls like every time you guys do this thing and it does my head in like and liberty can you guys also bring girls guys in that are not about like a stick figure or something like that they're not all about what the 
uh, cosmetic standard of beauty is because liberty is so beautiful but then we all these guys that all they're looking for is a slim small you know the that body that they think it should be then she's not gonna get anybody because the others are superficial <sighs> honestly honestly was in my head in now Callum, people are thinking oh the guys are saying that oh Callum is not that interested no he is interested but i think his personality is boring i can't even lie and he's interested in her but then he doesn't want to show it he doesn't want to see them like he doesn't want them to see him sweat but he does not understand that in that place when he does that they think that oh he is not that interested and i think that's what she also thought because of the kind of person that he is so i don't know if for three and a half years she did not even get his personality to understand the kind of person that he is now um so louise is focusing on demi mitch is focusing on demi so demi now is telling the girls that oh and mitch said then mitch is telling told the guy obviously that um that means it's number one then he told liberty that liberty chat to him is up there that she's up there she's like guy you've started again same chats just different seasons like same shit different toilets like honestly man oh like honestly it's just doing and then <laughs> anton i don't want to talk about jojo h and anton because i think they were going to go well but honestly they were both settling for each other so now jojo h is happy that josh is there josh is there to give it i was so happy for josh coming and he has not disappointed his chat has been given he said that the guys are acting like virgins because they are the girls are the ones grafting the guys are doing nothing like honestly these guys are just chicken that's what he's given i feel like it's because they came their own seasons they show interest in one girl and they feel like oh, i could have played more i could have done this more so now they're all just relaxing like not even chasing the girls like it's like the girls are the ones doing all the work it, it seems like they've kind of told the girls that the guys there's going to be a recoupling and the guys will be the one picking so they're working extra hard and they're in danger they're not in any recoupling that's what it's giving and why the guys are in safe relationship couples that's how the whole thing is given right now. But anyway, long story short, Georgia's date was really good. Georgia S, I said you're going to cry. I can't wait for you to cry, Sha. But every time, Toby, 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 this, Toby, that. Okay, girl, we shall see. And then Hannah. Oh, Hannah with him, their banter was everything. It reminded me of why I love season one. If I love Island is what love Island is today. Because season one started it. And then the others picked up. It was so good. Their bands, their everything. I don't know where your hand has been. I don't know. Ah, I was just like, this is so cool. And then Josh and Georgia H, obviously, they, they are friends with benefits. Or they've just been, you know what I mean? Whatever they've been doing. So, yeah. Apparently, the new world is spiritual because I'm spiritual. I don't know if I'm spiritual. That means I'm forgiven because before it was buzzing. I'm just buzzing. Now I'm spiritual. So, Georgia, forgive him because she's spiritual. And um, this guy is cool with Callum is cool with because they're spiritual. So they're also, everybody's just spiritual. So, please tell me what the meaning of spiritual is because I really don't know that. But anyway, long story short, Josh, Josh, Josh has come to put his you know, like I like his chats with Liberty. I'm like, oh, and cars. I'm like, Josh with my girls. I can't wait for what Josh is going to do. Josh, <laughs> it's going to happen. Cannot wait for the uh, recoupling to see if that's going to cause some, you know, I mean, some shaking. We shall see. Let's see who Molly is going to pick. Is she going to pick Callum? That would tell a lot. Anyway, that's that for tonight's episode. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If I forget anything, I've forgotten it. I'll see you tomorrow night. Bye-bye.